That was Jamarco pick it up ahead to Anderson, though, and he will lay it up and in, and we have our first points of the game. He's had to play point guard a little bit. He has the highest assist game in the G League so far with 13. That was in a game against the drive, as here comes Anderson. And as I say that, he scores on the end one, of course. York looking inside for Taylor, and he slams it home. Terry Taylor with the charge. Back out there for the charge, and York with the steal. He's going to drive and try and slam it, and ends up going in. So they're watching it in real time and game speed, and they're still able to get things right 99.9% of the time. On the other end, though, Anderson lobs it up to York, and he throws it down, and he's talking. He's, he's feeling it right now. Going to try and back him down now. Brown holds his ground. No call, and here comes York. He's got Anderson two on one. Back to York, and he slams it. Oh, game, York. And it seems that uh, Gabe may have gotten the technical foul. Got a guy like Nate Hinton that you don't have to run plays for, who, who already has 23 points leading the team in scoring. That was nice. Fouled on the back by Hinton there. You don't need to foul, him, right? No, no, no You just get buckets. <laughs> hey, you know? Taylor goes up with it, gets his own rebound, and then crushes it. Not sure this is what Cleveland was expected coming in tonight, but the Mad Ants don't stop running. Here comes Kendall Brown, the two-way player with the Euro step and the lay-in.